good morning guys uh, good morning i'll say good morning because it's not quite 11 o'clock yet <laughs> and welcome welcome back uh to my channel short urban medicine hope you had a great new year um uh, and uh christmas as well so um uh, we back at it again back at work and this is our first video uh for this year and today we're going to be talking about uh, aloe vera and the health benefits that you get uh, from the aloe vera now and also to before I get on into it uh, I am going to be showing you my uh, aloe vera plant that I have grown uh, I'm gonna have that on this uh, video as well uh, so you can see that okay um, I also know that they do sell pieces of aloe vera in whole food stores like the um the uh, stem thing and uh also to they sell uh out of your plants uh, in the whole food store okay now every well i won't say everybody i was about to say that but <laughs> most people know about aloe vera uh they know that aloe vera is great for the skin for burn for sunburn and things like that it's used as a juice people drink it uh, Walmart actually sells uh, aloe vera juice. Uh, I don't know if it's 100% or not. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, it is um, um, It is also using uh, skin, hair, um, and there are so many, so many uses for aloe vera and so far. And uh, we're going to talk about the digestive system. Uh, blood sugar level because aloe vera is really great for that as well. Uh, it is also, um, let's see, make sure I get all the details. Oh, for detoxing your body and things like that. Uh, and also, aloe vera can be used as an herbal capsule, which is, uh, uh, you know, really good as well. So, aloe vera can be formulated in so many different ways because. Uh, aloe vera can be used in so many different ways and it has so many many health benefits and so far okay as i said it, um the aloe vera is used for the skin like sunburn and so forth you take one of the plant stem and you can rub that on the burn uh on the skin uh it is also used in hair products for the scalp to help keep your scalp healthy to help your hair to grow um it is also used um also to um help with blood sugar level and all that um and also aloe vera is used um uh, let's see make sure i get it uh it's also used in foods and so far as well so you can drink eat <laughs> use it on the skin use it in the hair uh consume it for digestive system blood sugar level and also um for the digestive system if i didn't say that okay so these are all the things that you can use this beautiful tropical plant for and so forth has so many so many health benefits and things like that it is amazing amazing uh products and so forth and uh yeah um i've had this out of your plant for a while now we don't have aloe vera juice or the aloe vera capsules on our website but we will be uh upgrading those um to um formulations on our website this year so we will be having um uh, aloe vera capsules uh and we also will be having uh, aloe vera juice um dishaw herbal medicine okay so those are the two things that we're going to be doing uh this year and so far uh we're going to try to bring in some um herbal medicines and so far some new herbal medicine uh and all that um this year we did not bring in too many new herbal medicine last year we did bring in abuka i think that's the name of, i never been able to say that uh we did bring in sea moss uh and we did bring in um battle back so we did bring in like i think three herbal medicines uh in 2023 uh this year we're going to be bringing in number one is aloe vera we don't know what else we're gonna bring in 
but we're going to bring in and don't forget that you can still shop online for any of these herbal medicines and so far and that i am still listing slow listing um our herbal medicine on our facebook group uh where you can purchase it uh the herbal medicine all the herbal medicine eventually is going to be put on our facebook group uh on our in our shop uh we do now have a um show herbal herbal medicine holistic shop uh and all our medicine is going to be uh put on to that eventually uh the last day for the wix website will be january the 15th um and all that and if you don't see what you're looking for on our um facebook listed group shop uh just contact me because we still probably have it we just haven't listed it and as I said, we're going to be listing all the best sellers first and so forth, which we already have the Mullen. Mullen is which is our actual number one best seller. So we have that. We then we have Ray Co Clover. And uh for our next herbal knowledge, we're gonna talk about red clover as well. If I know what I'm gonna talk about, I will give you heads up on it and so forth. And I'm getting um really into this uh business here you know what i'm saying so i'm already ahead next week which is unusual because i never was like that in 2023 where i actually knew what we were going to talk about the day the following wednesday but hey new year new start fresh brain okay so now let's recap on the aloe vera and how great this herbal uh herb is it's a tropical plant and it has been used forever Oh, and you can also grow this plant yourself. I grow mine and so forth, which I'm going to show you again in this video, how big it is and so far. I actually have two, but I'm just going to show you that one large one. And so far, I'm going to bring that in. Uh, it is great for the skin of sunburns, uh, burns and so forth. Like if you burn yourself on a stove or whatever, great for that. Just get one of those um, plants and rub that on the burn. Uh, is great for, in the hair for the scalp to help heal the scalp, help the hair to grow. Uh, it is consumable. Uh, it is used as juice, drinks, uh, at the table in your foods, uh, and all that. Um, okay, and it's also great uh, for, again, the digestive system, consumable and so far. If you're going to use it uh, for, if you're going to use aloe vera for your digestive system, you need to have, um, they do make aloe vera smoothies as well. So you need to get a plant, uh, use the ingredients from the plant to make your either juice or your um, smoothie. You can do it that way. Uh, and I would recommend at least maybe two uh, glasses a day. And so far, aloe vera is safe to use every day, uh, to consume every day. Uh, also, you, um, you also can uh, do the aloe vera capsule. If you are using it for uh, your digestive system, um, blood sh sugar levels, and also for the... Um, um, detoxing and things like that uh yeah so i just want to make sure i'm not forgetting anything uh yeah okay for the detoxing and so far so uh you know if you want to use aloe vera this way make sure that the aloe vera is 100 percent organic make sure uh that when you are using or taking or consuming the uh, aloe vera for um you know, uh, any of these uh, digestive system, blood sugar level, and detoxing and so far, uh, make sure uh, that you are using it separate from your meals and things like that. Um, I always recommend that, you know, you keep herbal medicine that you're using for health separate from your meals. Even though you can use aloe vera in your meals and so far, but if you're using it for specific reason or you're targeting a specific health problem use it separate as you do any other medicine and so far um you know some medicine you have to take with food uh that means that okay 
uh, you can take it a um, uh, couple, uh, I guess maybe um, after you eat something right away because you, when you have to do that, know that this medicine is really, really strong, really, really powerful. And the food helps break that medicine down, which is the reason why they tell you to take it with food. Okay, so that medicine there can work for you with the food. So you either take it right before you eat or you take it right after you eat and so forth, which is okay because it's a strong medicine. But normally, um, if you're not getting medicine with uh, your traditional doctor that is strong and powerful like that and so forth, and they tell you take it with meal or something like that, separate it from the meal, you know. I say either hour before your meal or hour after your meal and so far. That's what I recommend for aloe vera um, to, to, to get those health benefits. That's what I recommend is an hour before meal or hour after meal so that your food can go down and so far. And then when you do use the aloe vera, you're targeting, you're using it and it's going to get to where you need it to go and so far instead of being mingled up with foods and things like that so that's the way i see it that's the way i've always recommended and so far uh i don't believe i've had any herbs that i would say you have to take with food or you know or, you know it's that strong that you got to take it with food now there is a lot of herbs that um you need to take for short term and so forth but it's not necessary that you take it with food or uh, like you know take it before you eat or take it right after you eat or something like that it's just usually uh you know certain medicine are strong uh herbal medicine are strong that you can only take for a short term short time and what you do is you take this for a short time you stop taking it and then you go back taking it again and so forth and things like that you give your body a break the medicine already in your system so that it's going to help you and so far until you start back taking it again so that is the reason behind all that and i thank you guys for joining me today on this shaw herbal knowledge on our channel shaw herbal medicine and today is wednesday and we're hey we're, we're getting it done early and so forth and now um, look for that big beautiful green plant that i'm going to be showing you in this video and thank you until next wednesday i'll see you then Bye. Uh, this is my uh, out of your plant. I'm going to stand back let you see that. Um, it is huge. And you hear Harley barking because he can't come out with me to take this picture. But here we go. It is beautiful. And as you can see, I got new um, stems come out. And when I said that um, these um, stems are sold at Whole Food Place... I'm talking about these things right here. Uh, these are so individually at um, Whole Food Place. Because these are where you can put all these. The gel in these is what you put on your burns and things like that. Or sunburn and all that. And also this is what you make your juice out of. Your drinks out of. And all that. And also I guess you can cut it up and put it. Make some kind of. Uh, put it in your food. Uh, some kind of way, but um, that's it.